songs. Like it wasn't that cold. Like if you wrap up in a couple coats and you wrap up in a sleeping bag and a couple blankets, you good. It was good. But I'm talking about cold and wind. When it's snowing outside and it's raining right. all the time and it's really fucking shit, you can right. die. You can die from it. You know what I'm saying? Like being exposed to hypothermia. hypothermia and all that. Those are things I was like, yo, now I'm gonna have to do this further down the line because I still want to feel it. I feel like I have to feel it up enough yesterday. You know what I'm saying? Like, I want to connect more. Like, this, this is important to me now. Like, people around me might not even know how important it's important, how much I'm about to act on all the stuff I'm talking about, but I'm about to really act. I'm about to really act on the things that are important. I'm gonna still make music because I'm a multitasker. I can make music, I can run a charity, I can uh, set up a charity event, I can uh, put a, a nice little kick back together, I can do a show all in the same week. Because we all can do that. Because we all are able to be great. You know what I'm saying? We all are able to fucking be bigger than ourselves and step up to the plate. And me, if I if, if, if influence, is it, it, it's renaissance. If you got influence, that's renaissance. You're changing the world. You gonna change for the better or the worse? What you gonna do? You know what I'm saying? Like, I know a lot of people, and I love my, I love everybody, but I know a lot of people that I know personally don't use their influence as strong as they can. That's saying they don't use it bad. You're just saying like, yo, you can go hard. Like, you got, you really got a name right now, yo. Like, you can go hard as shit. Like, you can. These people I know personally. Like, it ain't like I'm talking about people. Like, I know everybody. Else. This people I know personally. You can go harder for effective change and still make your music. Right. And still do your show and still make your money. I know that personally. You can make your money from your shows and you can still do good for people. You know what I'm saying? You it should be no reason why you come up off anywhere that you at if you do not provide for that place. If I go to any city that I go to, when I'm going on tour or something, when that shit happens, any city that I go to, I'm gonna I'm not even doing consecutive dates. I'm doing dates apart. So that way I have time to connect with philanthropy. I have, I have time to connect with community leaders so that we can create change and create databases in every place that we go. That's my dream. I'm, I don't care about music. Really. Like, I love music to death. Like, it's the only thing I want to do in life. But if I can do that, right. that's way bigger. Right. If I can create a network of people that all care about giving all over the world and they all talking about it at the same time, that's way fucking big. You know what I'm saying? Like that's way big. We got now we got we got we got a bunch of young thinkers. We got a bunch like when I went to this school and I talked to this school, it's the thing that saddened me the most, honestly, was that kids running up to me after, you know, I would speak to all the class and be like, You really think I can I can be a doctor? You really think I can rap? I'm like, the hell yeah, you can rap. And if anybody say you can't rap, they crazy as shit. I'm talking to them how I would talk to my friends because that's how they relate. Right. So I'm, that's why I was able to connect with them. Yeah, that's why the counselors and all of them at uh, Drew, uh, Drew Freeman Middle School, shout out to them for allowing me to do that because now I know that I can really, really use my purpose for good as far as the children. Connecting with them, rappers, all these things that they see on social media have more influence on them than their parents. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? Like, I got more influence over kids than their parents, honestly. And, and all these rappers that's, you know, they got names big in their mind, you got way more influence over them than their parents right now. Right. What you gonna do with it? You know what I'm saying? Like, what you gonna take do with it? At this level, like you're not waiting until it's, you have the celebrity and the cameras on it. It's like, oh, let me, it looks like publicity. It's like right now, while I'm still in the trenches trying to make this happen for myself, I've already had well, the I mean, mindset, mindset to do right, to do this it. This is my heart. Like, I want people, I want people to know that every day when they wake up, they're capable of affecting change. You are change. We are change. These kids change. You know what I'm saying? Like I can sit all day talking about I got a project coming out. I got this. I got music coming. Out. I got videos. I got. I, I create. I do it every day. While I'm doing all this shit, I'm make, I'm writing. I'm thinking. I freestyle songs. Like I make songs that will. This is something I do. Like that. I can make songs all day like this. This right here takes my thought. It takes me figuring out people to understand why we're not giving to each other. Right. You know what I'm saying? How can I use my voice to make these? So I get mad. I say, yo, I gotta, sometimes I gotta post like angrily because that's the only way the people that look at me relate to some of these people. I gotta talk to them and talk to their pockets. I gotta talk to the bottles that they pouring out in the club. I gotta talk to the, to the uh, strippers that they tip. I gotta talk to all of that in their mind. 
And when I talk to that, when you talk to that in a person mind, you let them know. And they know it. Like, these are things that we all know. So you ain't saying nothing to them that they don't know. Like, we all know these things. You know right from wrong. And it's that simple. I'm trying to talk to that part of you now. Like, I ain't trying to bullshit you. I ain't trying to sugarcoat the shit no more. This is, I'm going for peace. Like, that's how I look at it. Like, I'm going for peace. I'm going for the lack of genocide. We don't want a genocide. We are headed for genocide. You know what I'm saying? And not because the shit that people say is because the way we treat each other. You know what I'm saying? Like, you can't put all this negativity in the world and want positivity. Exactly. And there's no positivity to give. Exactly. There's no positivity exactly. to give. Everybody want to be millionaires and don't know how to make it. Don't know what it takes to make a million dollars. Don't know how much money, it, I mean, how much work it takes right. to get to these points. We, we look up the people who we think are these people. And I know a lot of these people who ain't these people. You know what I'm saying? Like, they ain't these people. I'm not coming from a church saying I'm a person, these people, because I ain't that person. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, you look at my shoes, green socks, I had these for a while, I've been wearing them for the last couple years. Yeah. My heart is in the right place. Like, I ain't, you know what I'm saying, perpetrating. I don't have nothing to lie about, I don't have nothing to say. And, and no rapper mode, I don't have no rapper mode. There's no rapper mode. It's just hippie mode. It's real life mode. And real life, you need to do each other. Hey. Real shit. I can't even, like, I would let you, it was beautifully said. It's no reason for me to even pick back off of that, but I absolutely fucking agree with everything you just said. And I wish that. As a, with all the influence that rappers do have, all that going it. on, they and don't stop even trying to charge these right. schools to come out and talk to these kids. Exactly. Why? I Why heard that. I do? heard that. Like recently, and I'm saying this on a here level because I'm in my area. I'm in my own town. I've been a lot of places so far. Thank Lord and blessed the music so far. I'm gonna do a little, do a little bit more than I was in the past. But I would say. If you got a name, you got going, you should never ever charge no fucking school. Come show up. Absolutely. And these are the ones, people that's making you. It's like, it's like, you ain't gonna charge radio to come out there for summer game. They making you come out to these, uh, to these big radio events because they've been playing your records. That's the corporate step. On a small scale, if you able to conduct yourself and make money off the of shows and you make a living off of music, and you able to say, I got fans and these people look up to you, you better, you better get them something to look up to. I don't look up to that. I don't look up to the perpetrator. I don't care about, I do, I smoke weed, I drink, but I don't look up to that. I don't praise that, that's not, I, don't, I, I like money, but that don't make me. You know what I'm saying? Like people, people look at money like they make them, like, nigga. <laughs> That's just crazy. That's crazy. They worship it. I don't understand that. Like, I see so much. And then, there <clears throat> be rappers that hit me want to do songs. Be on, be on, be on. Be rappers that hit me want me to do a hook, all this stuff. And I look, and I always look at your page. I always look at what you represent. And I see you 20, 20, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100. And then I tell you to pay for a feature because I don't know you. And you tell me you ain't got it. That is that's the new, what I that's hear. the new. That's, that's what I hear and I've been, this is multiple occasions. That's the new thing. This is multiple occasions. You tell me you don't got it, but I see you got it. To me, it feel like you got it. You can't come to me short because this is what I do for a living. I don't take no shorts on music. When it comes to business, I don't take no shorts on music with nobody. I don't care who you are. I know my work. So if you out there flexing, and you can present that in your, you your presentation, you but you, but when good. I tell you a price and you can, and it ain't, you can't even, oh, well, I ain't, you know, I can't even really pay right now, but, you know, let's just do it for love. Nah, it ain't no love. It ain't no love. Because you don't love yourself for lying to the people. <laughs> Not to the people. You don't love yourself for lying Stop to the people. Stop lying on the gram, y'all. All these artists out here with these rapper chains and these motherfucking videos. You don't love yourself. If you Hold stacks of money. Stacks of money. Who's money is it? If it's your money. If it's your money. Pay people for what they work. Exactly. But you they don't want to buy beats, they'll get free beats offline. Yeah, like, and then they get to start like even me. Like I look at like I like out here in the DMV area with the producers. Anyway, I got I got a name with people now. Like, I've been already, I got a little name right here as far as like local. So I would say this much. 
that on where I'm at right now, people don't look at me the same as when I first started. But in all honesty, I'm in the same place as I just started. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm a struggling artist. I'm a grinding artist. Right. I'm a grinding artist who takes a little bit of it he got and put it into other people. Nobody can ever, and that's one thing, that's why I get respect from a lot of people. Nobody can take that away from me ever. You can never say that I ain't never, I've been shady, or that I did bad business, or that I ever, uh, you know, did anything that's not about the culture, not about pushing music. I don't talk bad about people, even when people do me wrong. And that's life, people gonna do you wrong. I do not talk bad about people, and they, and they do me wrong. You will never hear about it. I'll never do no interviews, dissing nobody, and nothing like that. I got love for everybody. Because you was an experience, you was a lesson. You know what I'm saying? And prosperity and love to you. You know what I'm saying? It's not about that. All this shit is about doing what you can do. And doing the best that you can do. That's what I'm that's what I'm focused on doing me. Like me all the way. And once you do that, I feel like even with me, I'm like I'm literally telling y'all stuff that I'm telling myself as I'm telling y'all this. You know what I'm saying? Like do you, you know what I'm saying? Like people might have opinions, people might have, you know, thoughts of you, you can't worry about that because they gonna love you when you pop. The same people they got when I was dressing crazy, people called me all kind of shit, all kind of crazy shit that I don't like, man, I didn't know I was that. I didn't know I was that. <laughs> like when I was come back, like, I didn't know that. But when all that kind of stuff happened and stuff like that, I'm like, damn, there must be something. You know what I'm saying? They talking for a reason. They talking for a reason. I gotta be me. I gotta be me regardless of who you are. Fuck that. I gotta be me regardless of who you are. <laughs> yeah. So let's talk a little bit about your music for anybody who's been listening under a rock and haven't heard it. Currently, you're pushing the single on food. I got it. Let's talk a little bit about that track. We got it. a little bit about, I would think, from the current events in politics. Yes. Can you some more conversation? Absolutely. What? Oh, Are you yeah, crazy? I'm lit right you can guess them honor. I'm lit. Oh, Hippies yeah. get lit all the time. Have your cup, darling. I get lit, so that just is what it is. But tell 